Hi guys, Sai is here back with another interesting and most important video and this is method 3 video. Yeah guys, I am talking about how to install Jio TV on any Android TV. Actually, I am not going to take actual name of this method. In simple words, I will call it is a Tomox method. Yeah guys, it is a Tomox method. Okay, and the most important point is don't skip any part of this video otherwise it is 101% not working guys so note this point it is very important okay so watch this video till the end and if you are new on this channel then don't forget to subscribe also join our telegram channel where i provide important files and updates and also i made two videos on this topic already so that uh, apk interface is very simple and that method is very easy and very simple so if you want to check it out that both videos then those links are on description so definitely watch that video so without any wasting of time let's begin okay first of all visit on this github page okay it is open source don't worry okay so first of all visit on this github page and download this uh, apk on your android phone or um, laptop okay and transfer it on your android tv okay so here it is this is the open source github page visit on here after that click on this assist option uh, i mean latest this uh, option and after that scroll down this click on this assist option and after that it will open then you need to select the universal apk here it is that universal apk presently this is 3.1 latest version okay on when i am recording this video maybe in your case maybe your latest version re may be released okay so download that version okay after download that apk just transfer it through tra file sharing app or um, put it on pen drive and connect on your android tv after that install it okay click on install and it will take a little bit of seconds click on install okay and if it says something app is not safe like that so don't worry i already told you this is open source okay and go on left side on the bottom here it is click on more details click on install anyway that's it click on install anyway and install it okay okay it will take a little bit of seconds because it is a large size okay after completion of installation just click on open after opening it will take a little bit of seconds to set up it is a automatic setup okay so you no need to do anything just don't press any keys on your remote just wait it will it will do all things automatically okay so just wait for it and okay just wait and in the middle it will ask something like pop up and it will ask you something so let's see what we need to do on that pop-ups okay so let's wait for it uh, depends on your internet if your internet speed is good then this process done in very small time Okay, as we can see here it is it uh, saying it says display over lay is mandatory so we just we click on package installer then click on and in just install just once then install uh, click on settings uh, it uh, install unknown apps as we can see so wait some seconds after that it will show then enable this custard amox toggle enable this cursed amox toggle okay so after enabling just go back but um, i think we need to repeat this process after enabling this option because it will go back totally okay so again click on install repeat the installation process okay and we need to do this like like that because that display overlay feature we need to enable it so after enabling it will gone totally go 
back so that's why we need to repeat this process again okay so i installed again but don't worry after installing and after opening this uh, app uh, the process is continuing at the same position not from initial okay and it will ask again so click on just once after that okay click on install this is termux api click on install okay previously it's not going to install because one of the option is turn off in on our android tv what is that option that option is display overlay so after enabling after repeating that process it will installing successfully okay again now the uh, the various pop-ups is coming so we need to note these points as we can see the first pop-up is uh, asking select users method for custom okay select first option this is for tv right so select first option and click on okay as we can see on the right bottom okay now after some process it will again gives you one of the pop-up what that pop-up let's see so as we can see here it is the second pop-up uh, server at boot so select no then click on okay okay so again one of the pop-up is coming. so now what is the next step go on scroll down scroll down and select none then click on okay okay this pop-up is also done now what next again one of the next pop-up is coming. so just enter your geo sim mobile number okay and uh, click on okay that's it okay i'm entering my geo number i'm not show you total whole number because <laughs> you know i know <laughs> okay so i'm cut this video part after installing some digits of my number okay so after some seconds the otp pop-up is comes and just you need to enter that otp which comes on your that same number okay so here it is okay um it will take little bit of seconds because actually i am recording video from that same phone on which the sim card is installed that geo sim is installed so that's why i take little bit of seconds but i am entering earlier okay fastly entered okay after entering otp that said on the bottom of the left side as we can see this uh, geo box is uh, come okay so this box coming is necessary if this box is comes that means our process is done successfully now what next just uh, on upper side as we can see here it is web tv is present so simply click on that web tv okay so i'm going to click on that web tv just okay on that web tv after click on that web tv it will load and as we can see here it is the whole concept as we can see now you can search language wise you can search uh, category wise or uh, here it is a lot of options is present okay and everything is working fine don't worry okay and that sony that options is also working you can select language wise also here it is a quality option is also present you can set quality medium low high like that okay and you can search any channel okay here it on this interface and it looks like something different interface as compared to our uh, that geo tv right kodi on where which we are previously used on kodi right but it is it looks like permanent solution let's see how much time it's work okay so this is the method and in which some important point which we need to note that uh, okay let's wait i will play something like that okay as we can see everything is working fine without any issue right now so for due to copyright issue i'm not showing you in full detail so please don't worry it's working fine okay now what is important point so uh, on the top of the right side the logout option is present so don't log out it otherwise you need to do the this process repeat so don't do that on the top of the right the logout option is present don't click on okay on it okay and uh, if you exit this app so don't worry nothing uh, you don't need to do repeat this whole process again just open the just open this application uh, when you're going to re-watch any vi uh, video any channel okay so just open the your uh, that this geo tv app after that uh, 
go on that web tv option just click on that web tv option after that you are good to go to watch anything okay so note this point don't log out it if you log out it then it will not going to work you need to repeat all the process again okay ha huh. this is the important point okay and how you know you are uh, i mean this apk working or not when you again open this apk then what happens it will take little bit of seconds like 3 uh, to 4 seconds and for loading okay after loading the that geo box uh, that geo tv box on the left of the bottom is shown okay i will show you what that box as we can see here it is that box geo tv at the bottom of the left side as we can see that box is shown if that box is shown that means the method is the process is done and the app is working fine okay if that box is not shown that means the apk is not working so when you reopen this apk then it will take little bit of seconds to reload to reprocess that box okay so note this point so like this video subscribe this channel bye